welcome to the channel. My name's Harry and today we're fishing the River Avon for anything that's in there. Let's go. One of the ways many people, including myself, got introduced into fishing was heading out to your local river with a relative, being given any odd rod, little float on the end and sticking some maggots or worms on. Uh, that's because it's really simple and easy and that's what I'm going to be doing today. The river is really high, flooded, um, so I'm just finding little slack spots in the river and I'm just going to get out little pinches of maggots every three or four minutes or so with a couple of maggots on the hook and we're just going to see what we can pick up today. Um, there's nothing much to it, anything that floats can be used to float. Two or three split shot spread down the line and then you go down to your hook. This is a little size 16 hook but any hook will do as long as you can fit a couple of maggots on it. First fish of the day, folks. Good chub. Perfect little guy. Let's get him unhooked. Lovely little fish. Here he goes. Get some maggots into these slacks. Try and launch some. Grab a couple. Stick them on the hook, it's really simple. Just through the blunt end of the maggot. Good way to control them if they're wriggling around a lot is just roll them between your fingers and they'll freeze for a few seconds. Really bad at hooking them. There we go, I always pop the lid back on just in case I kick them over. Okay, now we're ready to fish. There we go, it's in the flow there. There we go. Fish on. What have we got? Oh, it's a lovely little trout. Okay. Tiny. Oh, it's a bit slippy. Tiny little brownie. There he is. Perfect. Fish on! <laughs> this little guy, this little minnow, he is hungry. See what I mean though, you can literally catch anything. I'm gonna get a few maggots down in these margins here. I wanna see if I can catch a decent sized little minnow. So they're just going right in front of me. See the trout and other bigger fish are out in that main flow because they can stand it. I mean, it's not the main flow of the river because this is an offshoot. Um, but they can stand that flow, whereas the little minnows can't. So they're gonna be hanging on in the edges of the pools, just like the one I've got in front of me here. Three maggots on the hook. Okay, I'm just gonna drop it right in front of me. And watch that float. There you go, it's under. Oh! This is gonna be a bit high octane here. There we go. Oh, that's a nice little trap there. Here he comes. Here we go, folks. Specimen fishing. Right there. Perfect. Boop. Okay, that's the camera done. Camera's died, so last 10 minutes on the GoPro then. Oh, here we go. 
It's a nicer fish. This could be the biggest, biggest of the day. Yeah, that's a nice trout. Let's measure him up. What are we looking at? 30, 30 to the fork. Nice. Let's see him go. And he's off, good, good fish that. Nice fish. Well folks, uh, that's the lot. It was a little short video today, but I was just trying to um, come out and catch a couple of fish and show you just how easy it is to catch them. Um, you don't need much, any basic rod, basic reel, some line, <coughs> float the hook and another pint of maggots and you are sorted, you catch anything on the river. Um, I'll come out here again and do this one day, it was pretty fun, nice catching, lots of little mini species as well, the little minnows are great um, and I'll get out of here when the river's a little bit less flooded. So, see you next time.